Welcome to Platelets Assemble. In this video, we will discuss the process by which endothelial injury drives the formation of the platelet plug, the essence of primary hemostasis. Over the next few minutes, we will discuss the following take-home points. Endothelial damage leads to platelet activation. Activated platelets adhere, secrete granules, and aggregate. Aggregated platelets form a plug, the key step in primary hemostasis. To understand the steps that lead to endothelial injury, let's start with the endothelium. Then within the blood vessel lumen, let's add red blood cells and platelets. If we look closely, we can see that the endothelium is producing both nitric oxide and prostacyclin. Nitric oxide and prostacyclin work together to prevent the adherence of platelets on the intact endothelium. Now let's introduce a break in the endothelium to simulate endothelial injury. Once the endothelium is injured, you create an opening in the endothelium that allows blood elements such as red blood cells and platelets to start to flow out of the injury site. At the site of the broken endothelium, nitric oxide and prostacyclin production is disrupted. The cessation of nitric oxide production means that its vasodilatory process properties are lost. In response, the endothelium tries, tries to stem the tide of blood loss by coming together in the process of vasoconstriction. Additionally, platelets are no longer inhibited from approaching the endothelium. Now, let's look beneath the endothelial surface to find subendothelial elements, such as microfibrils, laminin, and collagen. Remember that collagen is a strong activator of platelets and also a means by which platelets can stick or adhere to the endothelium. Nevertheless, the primary mediator of platelet adhesion is von Willebrand factor. Von Willebrand factor drives platelet adhesion by interacting with the platelet receptor GP1B95. With all the elements in place, let's add a few more platelets. Because platelets are no longer held back by prostacyclin or nitric oxide, they approach the endothelium and encounter collagen. Collagen is a strong platelet agonist and causes the, pla and causes the platelets to change shape. This is activation. As more platelets bind to the injury site, they also undergo activation. And as they stick to the injury site in the process of adhesion, they also end, um, have the effects of collagen, which causes the release of platelet alpha and delta granules in the process of secretion. Secretion enables platelets to recruit additional platelets in a continual process of platelet binding, activation, and recruitment known as aggregation. This mass of aggregated platelets is formally known as the platelet plug. Forming the platelet plug marks the end of the first step of the process called primary hemostasis. In the last few minutes, we learned the following summary points. Endothelial damage leads to platelet activation. Activated platelets adhere, secrete granules, and aggregate. Aggregated platelets form a plug the key step in primary hemostasis. This ends the video Platelets Assemble, the key steps in the formation of the platelet plug to achieve primary hemostasis.